Hi, I'm Joe Lally. It's good. There's been three shows. This is number four. This tour is 14 dates in a row. And it's sort of the northeast corridor of the, of the states. So uh, it's, pretty, it's pretty fast, but covering some ground. This tour is the first time the three of us played together, and it's, and it's uh, going well. There hasn't been any super low turnouts, which there can be. And maybe there will be on this tour. I mean, I'm not sure how to approach the question, because so much is different that it's hard to begin where. I mean, from the songwriting to the, you know, everything. I mean, it's so hard to explain because it's such different types of music to me. And it may not seem that it's that different, because I'm sure it's not wildly different to a listener. It's, it's different on some level, but both bands could be considered you know, rock bands or whatever. But it's really a different animal when you start talking about sound and, and how things are put together. I mean, we're just talking about like raising the volume level of the stage volume like so much that, uh, yeah, just you just enter a, a different sonic atmosphere. The excitement of not knowing what song is next and so forth, being without a set list, is definitely something that I kind of work towards getting back to somehow. And even playing with people that I don't play with very much is part of that where everything isn't totally understood every night, every moment. In the process of recording that first album, though, it was more, uh, it was more a feeling of being lost, though. <laughs> it was more like, wait, wait a minute. <laughs> it was more the discovery of what was working and what wasn't working and trying to figure out why I started recording the record that way. You know, like, wait a minute, what was I thinking? And then, you know, picking up from there. And so that informed the recording of the second record, you know, just say, okay, basic tracks are going down, drums, bass, and vocal. Nothing is Underrated came out last November. I suppose I haven't played here since that record came out, but Fugazi never thought about that stuff. It's really hard for me to think in that way because I'm so outside of the music business. There's nothing really that's, you know, giant wheel that's turning that I'm helping to, you know, feed into or whatever it's it's uh not something i'm too concerned with